what's going on here in Puerto Rico. We're at the end of that video. We're gonna get to the next one. Just eating and chilling. Let's get into this town and look at that right about. Yeah, man, you know what time it is. Yeah, man, what's going on? Uh, we're here at Eternal Con. Yeah, man, look at that Back to the Future. I want to put that up close. Yeah, man. It's a comic book festival held in Long Island. Uh, it's been going on for seven years. I went to the first two, and then it was at this little thing. Now it's really big. Really, really big now. It's at the Nassau Coliseum. Before it was like a thousand people. Now it's like fantastic. It's so many people. It's just fantastic. It's just insane. Sorry, sir. Yeah, man, we're here at uh, the Comic Book Festival. Yeah, 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 man, yeah. You can watch it on anything. Go on to anybody's channel all the time. You can like what you like. I'm just gonna let you go and see it from my point of view. I know it should be showing you from the opposite, but that's kind of strange, it's kind of weird. You can Google that or watch that somewhere else. I really say myself, you don't need to be seeing my sister said it was cool, but she don't even watch my videos, you know? I'm just trying to show you from my point of view. Why do you come to come, you know? Come to see me, my crazy faces, and see what I'm doing. I dare even talk. Like I say, it used to be really, really small. Now it's got really, really big. Uh, a lot of people here, a lot of people dressing up, uh, you know, it's pretty fantastic, pretty fantastic, it's really, uh, really big, it's cool to see, like, something go from, like, nothing to, like, something that's pretty cool, and I do say myself, it's pretty fantastic to know that it can happen, you know, like I said, there was less than a thousand people the first time, if that, uh, now it's, going to the Coliseum, so it's pretty cool. It's not as big as a lot of the comic book things and the other ones I have seen, but it is pretty cool. Now, if I do say so myself, yeah, man, and uh, it's got everything, you know. I see a couple t-shirt vendors, they're probably charging a lot more than they used to for a spot, but it is what it is, you know, the bigger you get. They're even charging $5 for parking, but it used to be for free. But you know, that's what it is when you go into larger venues. You gotta pay security, you gotta pay for all this stuff. And that's what happens. Yeah, man. So many different things. Look all these cool mats, right? Yeah. That's the thing you want to get you for Valentine's Day. <laughs> yeah, man. Pretty awesome, pretty amazing, right? Art and detail and all these things, it's like totally fantastic. It really is, it really is, it really is. Look at that, look at that. Wow, just think of haunted houses. Uh, it's kind of strange, but you know, it 
what is what it is, you know? That'd be pretty cool. What about that? Or we just buy this one, put it in front of the house. That's exactly the first thing everybody would want to see. Right? Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, man. Here with the, these things, I don't understand it. You know, I don't understand how to do it. Uh, yeah, you ever see me in real life tell me, don't call me. But I don't understand how these are popular, for real. I don't watch TV. And, uh, I don't trend. I know a lot of people buy this, but I don't know why. And, um, but it is what it is. I don't know the big thing. I don't understand. You know, I live in my own world. You know, I work in the travel, as you see from ups and downs of my videos. Uh, I'm all over the place. I just don't even understand it. Yeah, they even have Ghostbusters toys. Like, like they didn't have those back when I was younger. I know. Like, oh, the 90s, now 2019. Come on. Shows back in the days, Gargoyles. I still watch it. I don't know if I can find it on YouTube or streaming services. It's always cool to see. I don't say it myself. And then, yeah, many paintings and it's just fantastic. I'll do a 360 and see what I see. What is going on? Still here at a Journal Con. It was awesome. It's Long Island's own comic book festival. It comes in every year for the last seven years. Was there for the first two. Like I say, it was small, but this year is really fantastic, really big. It was awesome. You know, we even got the, the VIP thing. It came with a shirt, but I just wanted the thing because it looks cool. You know, something I just probably, yeah, probably not take it with me, but. Uh, you know, it was really cool, really fantastic this year. It was really cool, and I can't really say too much more about it. You know, they got these cool backdrops. This is always cool to like take a picture with. Fun pick, yeah, man. You know, it's just pretty phenomenal and just fantastic. You know, whoever uh, likes this stuff, you know, my friend Terrell, uh, Terrell Davis, uh, and Chris Malave. Yo, uh, they're the bigger ones in October, but as everybody knows, I go away for my birthday, my forty, uh, my forty-first birthday. I'll be away, and uh, yeah, I'll be away. Uh, don't want to say where I'm gonna go, but it's gonna be my uh, the, my sixth continent. Yeah, man. All I need is an Antarctica after, but like I say, Antarctica is gonna be the hardest one to come up with. As you know, it's not easy. It's not um, as good. Um, also, shout out to Kenny uh, Kenny uh, Walker. Shout out to James Grimes. The grinding, grinding, grinding. I see it uh, on Instagram. I see it on Facebook. That's phenomenal. That's fantastic. Uh, keep doing your thing. Keep doing your thing. Keep doing your thing. Keep doing your thing. Um, and everybody thinks I run with the team. I am the team. <laughs> there was nobody else. I come up with this. As you see, every time there's somebody who is different with me, just letting you know that I am the team, as you see, and as you see, uh, it's all become me. You can't, you can't knock it off. You just gotta watch it. Remember, you want to be the team because if they take anybody around you, you still want to be able to keep doing your thing. You know, you can't rely on anybody anymore. This is 2019. Uh, you can't rely on, any, on anyone. If you're uh, anybody and you want something bad enough, pursue it. It don't matter if you're. Uh, male, female, whatever it is nowadays, you pursue it. You know, this ain't no 1932, 1942, 1962, whatever it is, you gotta pursue it. You want that car, get it. You want that dream, get it. You wanna be who you are, get it. I'm just saying, get it, get it, get it. Don't be waiting. If you're a woman and you want that date, you want that too, go get it. You know, don't wait for that man to take you, because some of us know 
we ain't pursuing you, you ain't pursuing us. We smart. But to the next day. Here over at the Doctor Who thing, Doctor, yeah man. I know somebody's liking it. Yeah man, the phone booth, isn't that pretty fantastic? I do say so myself. Seriously, people who make the shirts, make them incredible hope look good. We're trying to get um, uh, Mark Ruffalo to uh, do the, the thing because uh, that incredible hope looks like that. Uh, for real, like all the characters, all the characters who make the incredible hope look stupid. But um, yeah, to the next time.